Hi, I'm Chris, and today I'm here in the city of Bristol. Let's take a look around, shall we? Bristol is the largest city in the west of England, and it's got a reputation now of being a very hip and happening place. It's a great base if you're travelling around the south or west of England, or it's an easy train journey from London if you just want a couple of days. Bristol has had a load of engineering connections, many of them relating to one of the greatest engineers ever, Brunel, who built the Great Western Railway to Bristol and beyond. Today, it's a very modern city with a lovely refurbished riverside area. And you can see a lot of it on the Bristol Ferry, a not-for-profit society keeping the city's iconic blue and yellow boats sailing. These take you around the city centre, including to perhaps Bristol's greatest tourist attraction, another of Brunel's achievements, the SS Great Britain. This was the world's first steam-powered passenger liner. It took its maiden voyage in 1845 and was actually the longest ship in the world for almost a decade. It's now been fully restored. There are loads of great buildings to see. Bristol's Cathedral is over 800 years old. And there's artwork decorating everywhere else. Bristol is a city of street art and the home of Banksy. One of the best ways to see this would probably be on a guided walking tour, and there are many of those. And then there's another engineering landmark, the Clifton Suspension Bridge, which is a must-see. It opened in 1864, and one of the best places to see it is from the Clifton Observatory. So is Bristol worth a visit? Absolutely. It's a lively city with lots going on. Do a bit of planning beforehand, take advantage of the ferry and any walking tours on offer, and you should have a really good time.